Show me what it's like to be circling among the clouds Because without you by my side I would be stuck here on the Hello ground. everybody! Welcome back to our channel! And welcome back to another video! Backed up! Episode... Who knows what? Is it like 19? That was not... That, there was no need for that. I find it hard to put No you spot. don't. So we've got Thank two you. different things today. I've got... Daniel's got KFC and I've favorite. got McDonald's. But you just... Right. I'm gonna wind What's up What's he doing? Today and He's walking his dog. Huh. Will he even be? Yeah, but he's here. He's living his life. Oh, no. <laughs> Look how the they hover. How does it hover like that? What a weird seagull. Leave the seagull seagulls alone, are weird. Man. What's this? What do you mean, leave the seagulls alone, man? What's this? You think you're talking to? Oh, got some popcorn chicken. I've got the trilogy box meal. Oh, if you know about the trilogy box meal. We're doing three separate videos today, guys. Yeah, I'm you doing do KFC and then I'll do well, my do you own. want this? We'll stop playing silly beggars. Oh my god. Otherwise, next time we'll get you coleslaw. <laughs> yeah, or beans. You won't like beans, will you? Why don't you get beans? Uh, I'm not having KFC beans. Why? End of the day, Daniel. I'm not doing it. <laughs> the end of the day. The end of the day. <laughs> mm. I, I honestly don't even feel like words are going to leave my mouth because I'm so hungry. I'm starving, mate. This is probably a bit weird, but I I prefer McDonald's chips, so I steal Nathan's gravy when he has KFC and I dip my McDonald's chip easy. Oh, see, I told you they wouldn't give me any sauce. Mmm. Told you. They go, do you want any sauce with that? Like, yeah, please, tomato. You don't, don't get it. it. Good job you brought your own from home. Got my secret stash. Go on, Heinz. We love you, Heinz. What's that? What are you talking What's about? What's that like chant that people do? We love you, we do. That one. <laughs> the we football love you, chant. Dinner. I don't know what it is. I have no idea. It's a football chant. Don't do football. Only I'm, when I was 12. I'd forever be grateful that you don't. And not like crazy about football. I think there's either gamer boyfriends or football boyfriends. Yeah, you kind of want all the other, aren't you? Yeah. Or, and you're either a stay-at-home boyfriend or a going out with the lads boyfriend. Yeah. Or there's um, I think there's a gym boyfriend. Or a gym boyfriend. Because yeah. if you're a, a proper gym goer, I don't think you have time to game or to love football. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? I well, think I could be a gym boyfriend. That's that's very stereotypical, but I could be a gym boyfriend. Mm. I just it's like very, my games very too much. Very peppery. that? Whoa. Well. I can't believe we're at the end of October already. Can you actually believe that, Nathan? Because... It's insane, isn't it? I genuinely am a bit shocked. I feel like October's been the quickest month... Oh, yeah, in the blink of an eye, it's gone. ...to ever exist. But then, after next week, from when we're filming this... Yeah. It's going to be Christmas, Christmas, Christmas. Oh, my God, stop it. It will. Best time of the year is from September onwards. See... For me. Personal right. opinion, you can't get mad at me. God. I'm not getting who's getting mad? How much is wet? <laughs> yeah, when I get them out. Um I have to wait. Right. Get out of the car and get back in when you're a nicer person. You got in the wrong side of the doll's morning. You got out the wrong side of the bed. Oh, I didn't. Yeah, you did. There's only one uh, side to get out of it, so if I morning. did, you did. <laughs> Didn't did it? Did everybody know that we don't have our own side? No, we don't, didn't it? And then a bug fell on me this morning night to yeah. wake Nathan up, and unfortunately, the bug had to be killed. Sorry if anybody's like. Why did you have to tell him that? No, but it had to be. There was no other way. It was crawling on my pillow. It dropped next to my head, and it looked like a mini caterpillar or something. But it wasn't a caterpillar, it looked like a worm. We on that we went off. Christmas. This best time of the year. Right, yeah. I think, right. <coughs> Chew Sorry. your food, you're an animal. It's not, that, that gravy's so peppery. Look, then. Mm. It's peppery as. Christmas, and like, I, I agree with you, after September, no, I would say October. No. October, November, December is just incredible. But I also love February, like, Obviously, mm. it's my birthday month. It's Kayla's birthday month. Yeah, like they're special occasion months. Like, yeah, that's. But I love good. February as a month. Like, I just think it's a great month. Yeah. Um, and I also do love the summer holiday no. month. I like going on summer holiday. Yeah, but then I guess it's there's not really anything hot. else to look forward to for the rest of it's too that hot. month. Go on. 
It's not too hot on holiday. No, I'm not on holiday. That's what I'm on about. The summer holiday month, that's what I just said. Oh, when you go on holiday, yeah, awesome, best time ever. But that month in general. Are you with us? But are that you in this family? Are you? I'm talking Packages about. this time? Don't do scratch cards, we don't buy lottery, don't, do lottery, we don't, don't buy, buy raffle, raffle tickets. tickets. Oh no, Mr. Wormwood, I'm talking about Matilda. I think Matilda would be better in a much more advanced You want Matilda to go to college? <laughs> <laughs> I didn't go to college, I don't know anybody who did. <laughs> Say if you get sick, the doctor, he went to college. Or you or get into trouble with the police and you need a lawyer. Lawyers? Who have you been talking to? <laughs> Uh, nobody. nobody. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, my big map's upside and down. And she points at the book and goes, she goes, she goes <laughs> 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 I fucking love Matilda. Me too, my Oh, fan. I love Matilda so much. I want to watch it. Should we watch it um, tonight? Oh, I actually love it, you know. What we've been watching? Um. So, I feel like we've been stuck on month. replay for the past, like, yeah. three months. And it's just been Vampire Diaries because we were talking about, right, obviously Squid Game came out. We haven't watched it yet. Not sure if we're going to. Don't think we will. Don't know if it's our kind of thing, but I feel just a bit like left out. Do you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Like, I, I just because like everyone's gone crazy about it. Yeah. But is it going to be me. that good? Who knows? It's meant to be. It's meant to be, whether it's my kind well, of thing. Well, then good. other people are saying it's the best thing ever. Then other people are saying it's not Can good at watch, all. Watch it. Oh my God, excuse me. Control yourself. Woman. It's gonna pour down as well, guys. It's literally black. Look over there, man. <gasps> demented, demented. Black clouds. Demented, demented. Obviously, Vampire Diaries has just been our life because we don't get any like. You know how some people can literally like fly through a series. We just mm -hmm. don't have that like time we together. Don't have the time. Do you know what I think it is? What? Because obviously, a few days out of the week both of us don't finish work until like 10 11 on a night yeah it's like that's the time that you'd usually be halfway through a series halfway through a series like you'd after your tea mm -hmm. you'd put netflix on mm. do you know what i mean but that yeah. just for a few days i feel like that's where we go like a bit wrong we don't have enough time on a night Mm. And obviously we're granny and granddad, so once it gets past midnight, <laughs> you won't find us watching Netflix while we <laughs> sleep. So nacho cheese bites is Nathan's favourite cheesy thing from McDonald's. I think McDonald's I mean, should keep these all year round. They should I keep wish, all of the cheese. I know. I things. don't understand why they don't keep them all though. Like, has nobody put this forward that we want? Mm. We want the camembert bites. We want the nacho. We want the mozzarella. We want the garlic and herb. We want them all year round. I don't want them all. I do. I want though. them all year round. But then, to be fair, I don't know how I'd pick between them. I would pick them every time. I have the dip with it as well, the sour cream and chive, because these are so spicy. So spicy. So spicy. Yeah, there's another thing on Netflix that everybody's watching as well is Made. Made. Like we, we do want to watch, watch that. that, don't we? Mm -hmm. And we also want to watch You because that's come out. We've got loads. Lock and you, Key's come out. Lock and Key has come out. You, have we watched any of you yet? No, no. we haven't watched any. Sex Education, we're like two episodes, two episodes. in. It's just like... We said the other day though, didn't we, about Sex Education? Yeah. No, but by the, by the end of that episode, I was like, yeah, I do. It's quite funny. It's like when we start the episode, we're it's like... We're trying to get into it, isn't mm, it? It was like, mmm. Because we loved season one, didn't we? Oh, yeah. But then did we? We did, I'm sure we did. I can't remember. And I loved, when we got to the end of that episode, I was like, oh, I want to put the next one on. Yeah, true. So. But then we're Granny and Granddad, and we've got, we've got Corrie to watch as well. <laughs> so that gets to know, because we I watch guess... that with tea. <laughs> Whereas other people might be like, oh, stick you on, or yeah. put the TV show that we're watching on. But we've got a thing where we can't eat. And for example, watch Vampire Diaries with all the blood and snacks. I need to concentrate on like when I'm eating. I'm concentrating on eating, so you need and like some a things like on. Of... Like I'm still watching it, but mm. with a Netflix series, my eyes need to be on the screen like the whole time. Uh -huh. I need to be in it. Okay, yeah. Do you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. uh, next month's packed up will be the end of November. The end of November. Mm. We'll be going what? into December. What? Will we finish Vampire Diaries by then? <laughs> Will we have finished? Next question. Um, Halloween plans, question mark. Yeah, I have a Halloween party as Which our Halloween plan. It's like a tradition for us. Mm -hmm. um, the past, like, is it three years? 
first year we threw a party was with all them B&M decorations that we decked the whole wall out in print and oh my god I remember that stickers and stuff that was about three years ago that was crazy I'm sure that was the first year um yeah Halloween I will never not dress up on Halloween and obviously I'm not somebody who would enjoy going out on Halloween like obviously younger years I did go out on Halloween and it's just sweaty it's packed <laughs> you've got face paint on that's literally dripping off your face like <laughs> it's just not a vibe um oh look at the horse oh yeah oh. are we telling them what we're being for halloween or is it a surprise um we can tell them i think we've already told them then mm -mm. i'm sure we've mentioned it Boy. yeah this is very hard to eat in the car mm -hmm. like really awkward i got a big out, did you? i even say what i got i got a big mac meal mm. Yeah, favorite. for Halloween we'll be in, um, does anybody watch Shark Tale? Because if you haven't, you won't know who we are. You won't. But we'll be in Oscar and Angie. Like, my mum has no clue who we are. Mm -hmm. She will not know who we are. Um, but yeah, I just feel like, because I love dressing up for Halloween, we'll never not have a Halloween party. Like, even if the rest of the family's like, nah, guys, don't fancy it this year, mm -hmm. me and Nin will be dressing up and having our own little oh, yeah. Halloween-themed spread, because... I just love it. Like, I feel like I used to get a bit embarrassed, I think, like being like, oh, we're just having like a family Halloween party because it's literally like we don't actually invite anybody. Oh, like, yeah, no. It's just us, but I don't know. Mm -hmm. I just love it. I just love putting a little spread on. I love dressing up and we usually... You love the planning of it at all, I just love you? the planning, yeah. We'll usually just put like either Casper or Hocus Pocus on like a bit later on in the night, um, mm -hmm. play some games. Yeah. It's just very wholesome, isn't it? Everything we do as a family is just very wholesome and yeah, love it. I just look forward to it. So yeah, that's the Halloween plans. Friday, which I don't know if it'll actually matter to you guys. Because I don't know. I think this video might go up on Saturday if I get a chance to edit it. We might do videos Friday, Saturday, Monday, I think. Ooh. Oh, this might go up on Halloween, actually. Because mm. pumpkin picking will be Friday. Oh, yeah. Then I think we'll do this on Sunday, so happy Halloween if you're watching it on Sunday. Mm -hmm. And then Monday will be the Halloween vlog. Love it. Love it. Good day. Oh yeah. We're going to see Harry Potter at the cinema. Mm -mm. I am literally so On the big, big screen. I'm sorry, this is going to be ugly to eat. I've just ugly eaten a chicken sandwich anyway. Don't see Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone. Oh my god. I'm so excited. I could literally... Because I was saying Nathan, like when Harry Potter came out, in the cinema. I never went to see it in the cinema. Which you said you did, didn't you? I did, but I didn't start watching them in the cinema until it got to Goblet of Fire. Mm. Was my first one. Mm -hmm. Oh wow. Did Philosopher's Stone and Chamber of Secrets go on the cinema though? The must of. I don't know. Did you collect stuff as a child? Collect stuff as a child, right? Might oh, be a bit. Fuck. Oh. Sorry guys. Excuse me. Might be my... a bit embarrassing. But, uh, oh, what do I know? Do you know about my teddy collection? <laughs> do you know about my teddy collection? <laughs> <laughs> you know about my teddy collection? I don't think so, I no. Literally, I would say approximately like 80 teddies. I had polar bear ones, I had fish, I had all sorts in the, in the corner of my room. And I'd had to say goodnight to each teddy <laughs> on a night. Otherwise, if I missed somebody out or somebody was missing, I felt so awful and I couldn't sleep. Did anybody else do that? But then they all, and then one day, just it's weird how one day you can just wake up and be like, I don't need them anymore, I just chuck them in the bin. No, see, that was never me. I chucked them in the bin. I felt awful about it, same as how you feel awful about Nintendogs, yeah. giving a dog away at the pound. See, I had <coughs> Teddy Collection as well, but I literally got to an age and I was like, this is like a bit embarrassing now for me to have all these teddies. Mm. But I literally can't get rid of them. Like I was like, <laughs> it, it just, I just thought of Toy Story all the time. I thought these toys come to life when I'm not here and I'm gonna either bin them or put them in the loft. And all I pictured was Toy Story. <laughs> just like me abandoning them. And it was just, it haunted me to be honest. So I'm not sure if my teddies are still in the loft to be honest, because Probably will be then. I don't even know what teddies I had. Like, I can't remember. Mm. I had a lot of themed ones. Like, I had, like, groovy chick ones. I had this monkey that wrapped around your neck. Oh, I had um, one of them. Yeah, I did. I don't know what um, else I really had. The Philosopher's Stone apparently did go in the cinema. Alright. So, are they all must have? Hmm. It's just telling me about what's happening on Friday at the minute. 
But it does say the box office, oh my god, it made 1.007 billion dollars at the box office. Oh my god. Do you know what we were talking about as well? I wow. wonder what McDonald's is the most bought item is. Yeah, we were. Because we were looking on the screen and it said pop the seagull. It's going to die for the... It's going to die for it on our window. It's... <laughs> I'm telling you. It said popular choices on the board. What was on it? Uh, 20 chicken nuggets. Yeah. Uh, a quarter pounder with cheese large meal. Yeah. And then the other one was... Hmm. Is it a big man? Chicken nuggets. It was a chicken nugget meal. Oh, yeah. Six chicken nugget meal. Yeah. A double quarter pounder with cheese large meal. And, and 20, then 20 chicken, chicken nuggets. nuggets. Yeah. Crazy right. So I wonder if chicken nuggets are McDonald's' is most popular item. I know, yeah. Must be. Mm. Collect anything else as a child? Mm. Collected Pokemon cards. Yeah. I collected shells, like from beaches, from holiday. And every time my grandma would go somewhere, she'd bring me shells back off the beach. And so I've got cute. one under the bed. There's like the one she got from Australia, and it's a massive like shell. Didn't your grandma used to get your sand? Am I making that up? Did you not bring your sand back? Yeah, but I think that was from a school project. I think that was for a school project. Oh, I I think it was on Australia. Yeah, I think it was on. Hmm. It was a school project, and she brought sand back from the Australian beach. Wow. Um. So So yeah, pretty interesting. eh? I don't. I don't remember what else I collected. McDonald's toys. Does that count? (laughs) Did you collect them, or was it just something you got? I don't know, I just don't think you've got you know it, I mean? isn't it? Yeah. What are you most excited? We did excite- get a McFlurry as well, by the way, sorry. <coughs> <laughs> what are you most excited about for the rest of 2021? Oh, most excited about? Yeah. The amount of stuff that we've got planned with the family. Yeah. Like, we're going to Manchester mm-hmm. next month, which is very exciting for Charles' birthday. Mm-hmm. I'm excited for Christmas markets. Mm-hmm. I'm excited for food, for crepes, for donuts, for... What else do you get from the Christmas market? Sweets, the Yorkshire pudding wrap. Decorations. Oh. The Yorkie wrap. Mm. I'm just excited. I'm excited for a possible a magazine feature. Mm. And that's all we'll say on the map. <laughs> I think... I don't want to say in case it's not true, but I'm pretty sure I'm going to be in Molly Makes magazine. Ooh. That you can actually buy in the shop. Mm-hmm. W. H. Smith, Watstones. I'm excited. We'll, we'll do, a, do vlog a vlog and, and we'll hunt down. Go on a hunt. Yeah. No, what we should do. We should do them. What them famous people do when a book comes out. What? Know where you go in a store. And you sign a few books. <laughs> and we'll go on over wherever you top your page, <laughs> and we'll just sign it. I'm so excited for Christmas. We picked the dinner theme, mm. like the tip, the Christmas table theme. We haven't told anybody though. We're keeping it a secret. Last year we obviously had like a pastel pink. Like gingerbread theme, didn't we? Yeah. Um, but this year is going to be pretty different. We like traditional colours. It's very traditional colours, but not exactly a traditional theme. Theme. Yeah. But it's obviously Everly's first Christmas, so. Mm-hmm. It's going to be so cute. It's going to be very cute. Mm-hmm. If you got £1,000 and could only spend it on yourself, what would you buy? I don't like spending money on myself. <laughs> exactly. Um, a thousand, what would you buy? This is so hard for me because I literally don't. Mm-hmm. I'd buy some Pokemon cards. I think I've got a letter stuck in my tooth. Games for the Switch. Games for the Switch, yep. Yeah. Next. Um, you haven't spent your thousand yet. I'd have to yet. buy some clothes. Right. But are you, are you allowed to buy them for me? <laughs> no. Because I can't pick. <laughs> I'd get a stylist to, to style me. <laughs> I would spend mine on a new coat. Mm-hmm. Um, I'd get two new coats actually. I'd get a, pu- a beige puffer with a hood. And I'd get a trench coat. Maybe like a brown and black one. Um, I'd get this candle that I've seen on Etsy. Um, it's a, like an, it's, I think it's called Namaste. And it's basically like a, a person with his... Oh, should I just show you it? It's a little namaste person and he's got his legs crossed. What? And his arms up. That is so cute. Isn't he cute? And I'd, I'd style it like that with a plant next to it and a little wooden well, slice. Well, Santa might bring you one. Well, maybe. Mm. What's That's the, if I don't treat myself to it. <clears throat> Cozy Land Ooh. UK with a Z. <clears throat> They've got 4,399 sales. They're very cute. You should follow them on Instagram because they do insane. Excuse me, candles. 
else would I buy? Food. Yeah, food has to be one. Um, it's necklace because I'm quite into necklaces that you don't have to take off. Like, you know, a necklace that is just like, like somebody looks at you and it's like, you always have that necklace on that's just like mm -hmm. your necklace. You know what I mean? I know what you mean. Like my Aquarius one, I obviously wear it a lot, but I don't have it on today. And it's got like a sharp bit on it that digs in sometimes. It's a bit like annoying. So I don't always put that on. Um, but yeah. What's your favourite date to go on together? <clears throat> favourite date we go on together? I love our cinema trips. And I love our park walks. I would say our park walk dates are my favourite, to be fair. Do you know what? Like forest vibes. Like forest. Do you know what? In the woods. I would agree. For a budget friendly date, mm -hmm. our forest walks are just... I just um, love them. I look forward to them. They're just yeah. very cute. I love it. There's not much to it. Like, we have a lot more day dates than we do, like, night Night dates. time. Do you know what, though? If we're talking, like, nighttime dates, mm. I love being in another city and getting properly, like, dressed oh, up, yeah. going for a nice meal, and going for cocktail. some cocktails somewhere, because we don't do that often. Yeah. Like, say every, every weekend, if we went out and mm. had, like, drinks and cocktails every weekend, mm. I feel like we wouldn't appreciate it as much. Yeah, no. But because we don't do it often... When we go to a city and we do it, yeah, it's like Especially. exciting, yeah. yeah. The final cue mm -hmm. that they need an A to. Have you started buying Christmas presents yet? I need ideas. I have bought Dinny two presents. I've bought Nathan literally three things. Up to now. We've set a limit this year for each other. Um, last year we did 25 for obviously the 25th of December. Mm -hmm. But because we are attempting to save up for a house, house um we've set a 10 limit this year 10 so that's crazy <laughs> i hate sticking to that i'm gonna find it so hard because then you have to like whittle down like what what is worth it and what's not worth yeah, it yeah but then i feel, I feel like, like that's like, a good thing though yeah but i feel like i'll end up buying it and just giving you as a treat <laughs> ideas so dinny is quite an easy person to buy for to be fair yeah. Like, one of the presents that I've got you this year is probably not... You wouldn't expect it. Right, well, what advice would you give mm. to males trying to buy for females, whether it's the girlfriend, the mom, whoever, and I'll give advice for right, men. Right, so, advice for girls. Yeah. Lads, listen up, right? <laughs> girls, girls won't complain with candles. <laughs> right? Candles... You know, candles, <laughs> wax melts, get a new cute wax burner for them, <laughs> get them some cozy jammies, get them in like a self care kit, you know what I mean? Like put in a box or a hamper, Literally, like face mask. Even you could even Google um, Etsy, go on Etsy yeah, and search, and buy search spa self care package. Yeah, do that. Or what you can do is you can go into the bathroom you. and be like, ooh, what shampoo did they buy? You know, like something cute mm. where it's like, oh, 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 like I need shampoo. Yeah, shampoo's not a Christmas gift, is it? But. If it's it like all together. together in a hamper in like a kit, That's a cute idea, they've got like makeup wipes, micellar water is key, mm -hmm. um, get them a new headband to when they do the makeup, mm -hmm. find their favourite lipstick that they wear all the time and then be like, so got you this as a replacement. Thing. That's very You know what I mean? Cute. Like a cute hamper is like the perfect gift, I would say, mm -hmm. of all of their favourite things. Because mm -hmm. each one separately is like, oh yeah, thanks, you got me a replacement. But then all together, it's like that's so thoughtful, thoughtful and caring. That you've, yeah, uh, it's very true and very cute. I would suggest that as being. I love that. Top tier. Mm -hmm. Get you in the good books. Mm -hmm. I just say the same thing. Find whatever their interest is, whether it's golf, Pokemon, gaming, coffee, um, Minecraft. Minecraft, yeah, like any whatever the interest is, and go, literally go on Etsy and put. Whatever the thing is, gift. Or mm. put personal put say for Nathan, I'd put personalised Pokemon gift. And honestly, you just can't go wrong because the amount of things that'll come up mm -hmm. you're not gonna be stuck for ideas. Yeah. You're gonna be supporting a small Let Etsy business. Give you the ideas. Yeah. Instead of you trying to sit and think, because something will come up, say like, I don't know, it might be like an a, a towel. And you might think, oh, well, a towel's a bit of a shit present to get someone. But if it's an embroidered towel with, like, I don't know. Oh. I know, and it's you can get, like, golf, whatever, on a towel. Or you could get, mm. like, Harry Potter on a towel. I don't know. Anything. Yep. 
bath bombs are a good one as well. Yeah, bath bombs can't go wrong. Bath salts for I think bath salts for males are better than bath bombs personally. Yeah. But you love a bath bomb, don't you, Nens? I love a bath bomb. I like ones with hid uh, hidden surprises inside. What's going on with this parking? I don't know. A bit weird. Oh, also a good idea would be to um, <clears throat> find out if they've got any subscriptions that they pay for monthly. Yeah. And buy it as like the year thing, so they don't have to worry about paying for it monthly. Or something. Yeah, a glossy box is a really good. You can do one you can do off. Three months. Yeah, you can do three or months. One you can off do a one off thing. Yeah. A glossy yeah, just, box is just a really find something good. that the person is interested in. So it's like a lot mm -hmm. of like thought has gone into the present mm -hmm. you know what i mean yeah just go it's it's easy if you think about it is it though don't make it so complicated for yourself i do think there's some people hard to buy for though oh there is people hard to buy for but i think you can't go wrong with a hamper kit a hamper kit yeah or a box full of stuff that they like yeah even if it was a big box full of chocolates and sweets that they like yeah like What's wrong with that? Yeah. That's awesome. Amazon do a really good, um, like, it's it's called, like, the Big Biscuit TV box or something like that. Mm. And it's basically a giant box with loads <clears> of, like, different biscuits in. Yeah. Really good. Um, spa so, treatments. Yeah. Spa that's treatments, good. if you go on... You can even get a gift card. You don't have to buy the full-on <coughs> spa treatment. You no, but that's get... a bit stingy. I wouldn't do that. I wouldn't be able to give somebody... For a friend, I would. No, if I wasn't paying for it for them, I wouldn't be able to give them it. Because oh, it's like, what that? if they can't afford to pay the rest of it? You've only no, paid but, like half of it. No, you but you can get like a £25 gift card for the spa and they put like an extra £10 to it. Mm, well then, wouldn't you just put the extra £10 to it? Mm, I think that's And what idea. spa are you getting for £35? I talked a lot in this one. Fine, not at first you didn't. <clears throat> Remember when we first started and I used to be like... Mm -hmm. Like that. And I didn't used to say anything. I was too busy chomping. No, I just like to too walk. Too busy chomping. I like to wind you up. Yeah. So that was the episode of Parked Up. We really do hope you enjoyed it. Mm -hmm. Thank you all so much for your questions. And if you did enjoy the video, don't forget to give it a like. A what? A what? Don't forget to give it a like. And a thumbs up. <laughs> and what? That doesn't sound right. Is that what it you... normally is? A like and a thumbs up. Because <laughs> we've always done it. No, it's, it's give thing. it a big thumbs up. And a like. And a like. <laughs> Oh God, we're switching sake. it around What's recently. Going on? I don't know. I don't know. But God. yeah, thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you all in the next video. Peace out. Peace out. Happy Halloween. You're lighting up the way I can see the road ahead of me.